well hi folks uh, in this video i'm going to show you how to downgrade your uh, asus zenfone 5 from uh, lollipop to kitkat so uh, let's uh, follow a step by step uh, tutorial uh, first thing that we'll do is we'll log on to asus.com and uh, once you're on the page click on service click on uh, more and uh, since I have an issue Zenfone 5 I would just uh, put my model number that is A501CG the moment you do that uh, you need to click on the phone's model number and it will take you to a new page here you need to click on drivers and tools and uh, in the operating section uh, operating system column we need to select uh, android and then we click on firmware so uh, guys uh, the sku in my phone is ww that's worldwide so uh, there are many uh, downgrade versions as well uh, so let's be careful and let's uh, look for the right uh, firmware for downgrade okay so here we are this is what we require we uh, require ww underscore 5.3.3.3 uh, downgrade version this is the version that we need to download okay and uh, once you download this you need to even download version uh, ww underscore 5.2.2.2 downgrade version uh, well uh, what asus is asking us to do is it's asking us to uh, install both these uh, uh, both these firmwares in order to uh, have a successful uh, downgrade from lollipop to kitkat okay so uh, for the video purpose i have already uh, downloaded uh, both the firmwares so it's ready so all we need is we need uh, ww underscore 5.3.3.3 as well as 5.2.2.2 uh, now uh, once you have downloaded the uh, both these firmwares the next step that you have to do is you need to uh, connect your phone with a with a usb cord in your charger to your laptop and uh, once you do that your uh, phone will show the internal storage and uh, we'll just click on it and uh, we'll paste the first uh, firmware that we downloaded that is ww uh, 5.3.3.3 and then we'll unplug the phone and uh, once we do that our phone should uh, show a notification of uh, system update so yeah See, this is how your phone has to show you a system update file detected uh, notification. So the moment you see this, you have to click on this and uh, select update package and uh, we just say OK. System update will take several minutes. You will need, you will not be able to use your phone uh, device during this time. Please connect the power adapter or ensure that the battery life is at least 15%. So guys, uh, uh, just make sure that you all uh, charge your phone to 100%. That will be uh, a good idea because we don't want our phone to run out of battery while the installation is in process. So now let's see. So now the, the phone started the installation process uh, well uh, one more uh, notif uh, like one more thing uh, to your notice would be that uh, both the firmware uh, would take a good 15 to 20 minutes so uh, it will be really it will be suggested that 
we remain uh, patient and uh, secondly uh, your screen uh, you know during this installation process would uh, get blank for a good 30 to 40 seconds so there's nothing to worry it's a part of the installation And uh, at the, I would say the, uh, the progress bar would uh, actually get stuck at this point. So nothing to worry. Just leave your phone aside for a good 15 minutes and uh, it'll restart on its own. And we'll start, uh, we'll uh, install the second uh, firmware as well. Okay, so let's be patient. Uh, so after a good uh, 15 to 20 minutes, the phone restarted on its own and uh, I got this notification system update uh, system update system has uh, been updated successfully so press ok and uh, select the preferred language that you want So as of now, uh, after the first update, the phone is still uh, at uh, Android 5.0. That's it. It's it's still a uh, lollipop. So now I'll again connect my phone to the laptop and copy the next uh, firmware. That is 5.2.2.2. So let's go ahead and do that. So now let's copy the 5.2.2.2 firmware and paste it to the internal memory. And now once uh, the file is copied, again uh, unplug your USB cord and uh, your system will show a uh, system update notification. So just uh, get through the process once again. And it would be uh, really good if uh, you can back up all your data because uh, after the first installation, uh, after the first uh, firmware installation, the system as totally uh, erased all the uh, data that I, that I had in my phone. So you all make sure that you all have a backup of uh, the entire data you all have in the phone. So once again, uh, my phone is showing me that there's a system update file uh, detected. Click on it again and uh, see this time it's showing a WW 5.2.2.2. So press OK and uh, let it install.
as per the process again your phone will restart uh, sorry it, your phone will go into the boot mode and uh, in the meanwhile you know even if possible uh, make sure that you remove your uh, memory card if uh, in case you have it in your phone because uh, the data in the memory card could also be erased so the uh, firmware upgrade uh, that was uh, ww2 5.2.2.2 uh, comparing to the 5.3.3.3 uh, was uh, pretty quick I guess uh, it uh, got updated within 10 minutes so again it's uh, showing me that uh, there is a system update so I press ok and selecting this finally now let's check the version ASU software update so see the moment uh, we have downgraded ASU software update has been offered to us so um, because as we saw in the website that mentioned that it's only for version 2, uh, version 2.21.40.44 so now uh, when you download the update your uh, phone will uh, be up to date that would be version 2.22.50 uh, sorry 40.54 from where uh, you actually updated your uh, two lollipop okay so that's it guys uh, that's all for me okay enjoy and uh, do share your experience and uh, like share comment take care and uh, like i'm really sorry i did, i forgot to show you the build number so immediately after the uh, immediately after the uh, downgrade now the version is 2.21.40.44 so now successfully you have uh, downgraded your phone to lollipop and uh, uh, sorry to kitkat so many people I, I heard on the internet that uh, they said that it's impossible to uh, downgrade your phone from uh, kit uh, from lollipop, lollipop to kitkat so just remember one thing nothing is impossible take care have a good night